The 2018 student government debate featured candidates for treasurer, speaker of the student senate, student body vice president, and student body president. The candidates discussed issues that many University of South Carolina students face, such as parking, student organization funding, mental health, and sexual assault. And so one of the biggest things we want to do is build a pedestrian bridge over the railroad tracks that are next to Green Crossing and Park Place because those students are trying to walk to campus. United Carolina was always about establishing personal relationships between organizations far before the organizations were expected to work with each other. If we throw around words like empowering our student body, we need to actually give them a voice. And I think not only should we be intermediaries between the students and the administration, but we should make public what the administration says to us. I want to make sure that every single person on this campus has that exact same feeling that um, no matter where they come from, no matter their background, ethnicity, um, you know, their sexual orientation, that they know there's at least one person in their corner empowering them. I, I thought it was, you know, really awesome to see them be able to get on stage together and talk about what their vision is. I think uh, they all have uh, ideas about how they can make the, the student body better. We want to energize Carolina. Uh, we want to empower the student voice. We want to empower all of your voices and make sure that your story is being told as well. Um, when Catherine and myself sat down to think of words like embody our campaign, the word Ignite came to mind. Our goal is to reignite the passion of student government. We are going to unite student organizations together in collaboration to get the student body what they need. We're going to advocate for mental health awareness. We're going to host our first mental health summit here at the University of South Carolina. We're going to advocate for student org equity by making sure that no matter how large or small your student org is, you have the same voice that the four execs who sit on the board of trustees do. The candidates for treasurer, Emerson Odegas, Eugene Sudam, and Wilfredo Anderson, specifically discussed how they feel about the role of student comptrollers. The candidates for the new position of Speaker of the Student Senate, Patrick Ellis and Aaron Greenberg, were focused on discussing how they think the position can benefit the Student Senate as well as the student government as a whole. I thought that they touched on current issues they talked about them in a dignified way that didn't dance around the subject. Elections will be held February 27th and 28th. Make sure to cast your vote. For SGTV News 4, I'm Jordan Beener.